Hey, I'm Sycamore, and I have a new EP out called California King that you can listen to on your favorite streaming platform. Today, I'm going to be doing five questions for the reviews are in. I'm playing an album front to back with no skips. It's probably Born to Die by Lana Del Rey. It came out, I think, in like 2012, but it is aging like fine wine. I can't get enough of Lana. She's one of my favorite artists, and I think Born to Die was the album that defined that decade for pop music. I would definitely say the Hollywood Bowl in LA. Um, there's something about those outdoor theaters that are just so special and I actually did see Lana Del Rey play there this fall and it was so infectious and intoxicating just to be there in the audience. I can't imagine the high of playing it as the headliner so that's definitely a bucket list item for me. Definitely say somewhere in the Caribbean. Um, I went to Jamaica a year and a half ago with my mom and my sister, and it was such a fun vacation. I love rum, that's where they make it. Um, so I'm kind of itching to see the rest of the islands over there. I'd love to maybe do St. Lucia next or St. Vincent. If I'm a musician, I'd probably be an interior designer. Um, in the last two years, I've really discovered a passion for design and putting rooms together and picking out palettes and stuff. Just from my own experience and helping friends with their homes, um, I've realized it's something that is just another creative outlet for me and so if I wasn't a musician that's probably what I would do. Artists that I think people should pay more attention to is a guy named Patrick Droney. Um, we know each other a little bit, we're friends, but I'm genuinely just a fan of his music. He's sort of this hybrid between Kings of Leon and John Mayer and something just totally fresh and his talent is boundless. His songs are so good and I think people need to pay attention before he blows up.